My name is Crescencio Ferreira and I'm just graduating from the MA Documentary Film course at London College of Communication. My film is called The Priory, so it's like a portrait piece on a rapper from North London. So he kind of just like tells you about how he got into music and it's kind of like him recounting his like youth and then it's also about the estate that he lives in. So it's kind of a portrait of him and the place he lives in. Spitting 50, 16s and a Nissan 9 With a chain on my hip, tripping out life ain't I want it to be like a story about a kid who's from an estate and he doesn't get himself into a situation that is like a bad situation, which acts the narrative of a lot of films. So I just wanted to do something different. Well, documentary film kind of was what pulled me in just because I like meeting real people. So I actually did like my undergrad in something completely different. I did it in uh, politics and international relations. So um, I kind of, in my first year of uni, I got into like taking pictures and then I started getting into photography quite a bit. And then maybe like my second year of my undergrad, I started like getting into videos because obviously it's like kind of a natural progression from like photos to video. And then I was still kind of interested in politics and stuff, but like film was like my new like kind of passion. I've kind of stuck with it since. Even though I was doing work for like people that are musicians, the way it works isn't a professional relationship, it's more like me talking to my mate. So yeah, now I know how to approach things on a professional level. Uh, I'm not nervous yet, I feel like maybe I'll probably be maybe a bit nervous when I'm like sitting down watching it like everyone's here, but um, I'm excited because, you know, just watching it in an edit suite, it kind of, kind of becomes like a separate thing, it doesn't even look like a film anymore to me, it's like, so I haven't watched it for like, since I finished it, I didn't want to, I haven't watched it again like all the way through because I've just seen it too many times now. So I want to like refresh my mind and then watch it again on a bigger screen.